Now, it's going to be a long time with this pandemic before things go back to normal. We don't even really know what the new normal is going to look like. But an Israeli company called Aid Genomics is helping us get there faster with a new test for COVID-19 that can be processed in only about 45 minutes. In fact, the company claims that the test can revitalize the tourism industry while preventing the collapse of the healthcare system. Joining us with the details is Aid Genomics' chief scientific officer, Dr. Yitzhak Khaviv. Doctor, thanks for being with us. Now, you offer a kit that offers a quick and easy solution to detect the coronavirus. But how is your test different from those that are already on the market? Really, it was um, uh, components of the same procedure as the normal test were interrogated specifically for the speed of performance. Mm. And uh, in every step of the way, there are faster and slower ways. Usually, the faster ways will also compromise the results. So we um, combined the speed measurement with the robustness. Uh, the other aspect of the development was simplicity of use. But otherwise to that, uh, the kit is composed of a standard reverse transcription quantitative PCR, just like uh, the clinical labs perform specifically in Israel, 26,000 today. Wow. So how, how soon can your tests be on the market? And did, did you get FDA approval? We're in the process of uh, preparing the filing. And uh, because of the EUA, that uh, means uh, uh, a number of weeks, probably more than a month, but a number of weeks until we have uh, that prepared and finished. All right. Now, now who can use this kit? I, I know you mentioned ease of use. Can it really help uh, you know, the, the industries that are currently disabled as well to get back to business? So although initially it was prepared for airports and for border controls, uh, we are in uh, also negotiation with soccer teams, with uh, 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 movie industry, wow. a lot of multi-participant events or uh, employment sites are interested. Uh, of course, tourism is the first and foremost, such as the navies, the, the ships, Wow. All right. Now, my final question, I kind of want to go backwards a little bit. I understand that you've actually already been collaborating regularly with the Israeli health ministry, providing thousands of tests and accessories for tests for COVID-19. You know, what can you tell us about this partnership? So we, we are in joint venture with BGI, which is um, a Chinese company of next generation sequencing, and they were the ones who identified uh, the COVID-19 genome and offered the first kit. Uh, not the first in the world, but uh, we as their partners could employ it here in Israel. It, in, it started with a gift and then uh, from uh, increasing number of uh, kits being purchased, we saw quickly that the infrastructure in Israel is not up for the number of sus suspected cases and uh, assisted in implementing this um, technology uh, also in the infrastructure and accessories. Uh, specifically, we provided to six uh, laboratories of the HMOs in Israel, wow. Klalit, Mohedet, Lumit, so and really, Maccabi. So you're really spreading it out there and, and making sure that yeah. everything was available. All right, Dr. I would Kavir. say 14,000 uh, of the tests today were performed wow. in sites that we wow. implemented. All right, Dr. Khaviv, thank you so much for the important work that you're doing. And thank for you very much. Today. Thank you.